Hey guys, what is up? It is me, Pagey, here once again with another video on Legends of Tomorrow Season 4. And well, it's Comic Con time, so you know what that means. The trailer has arrived, so let's just watch it and then we'll break it down afterwards. Today is the day that we prove that Rip did not sacrifice his life in vain. And today is the day that we prove that we are not losers. I love, love, love you. And today is the day that we earn the name Legends. Our crazy plan to let Malice out worked. Finally, we're not screw-ups forced to clean up our own mess. For once in our lives, we are actual heroes. All I'm saying is Constantine promised us magical monsters. So, where are they all hiding? I want dragons. You guys are time-traveling superheroes? <laughs> yeah, we've actually saved the world. Really? You saved the world? Oh my god, it's Paul Revere! Twice! Then why does it still suck? Four years doing the same old crap. Is that what I think it is? Couldn't have been heroes for just a little bit longer. Oh, relax, Sarah. We didn't screw things up for the better this time. We screw things up for the more magical. Hello, John. Sarah, the darkness, it's rising. Malice wasn't the only prisoner to escape his realm when you decided to pull back the veil between our worlds. <laughs> Throughout history, immortal monsters have returned to prey upon humanity. The only thing between life as we know and complete pandemonium is you bloody wankers. The legends have things under control. Show yourself, because I'm a nasty piece of work. You will not escape. The Bureau needs the legends now more than ever. We're a team of outcasts and misfits. You're one of us. I'm confused. We are all happy that there was only one dragon, right? Well, it would be good for our ratings. But don't worry, we have a few dedicated fans. I'm an interim legend. Yeah, Gary doesn't count. Enjoyable trailer. Obviously, there was you know some stuff we've seen before, but that's expected. Sometimes when they haven't maybe filmed so much or a lot of CGI is required. So yeah, but if you um go on to enjoy the video, it would be awesome if you could drop a like just to show your support for Legends as well. Let me know in the comments what caught your eye in the trailer, what uh, made you smile a bit and laugh a bit. Let me know in the comments, and of course, if you are new to the channel, make sure to subscribe. So the trailer starts off with your typical just bit of a recap to start things off, mainly to lead into what happened because this season obviously. You know, if you started watching season four, you'd be like, why are there all these things around here? And it's because of what happened at the end of season three. So just explaining the whole malice thing and everything like that. And we also get some more Bebo and we love Bebo. It's actually funny hearing the legends say that they like want magical monsters because obviously when Constantine appeared at the end of last season and we're like, "You, what have you done? And, and dropped the dragon's head. They must have been going like, oh, okay, we've stuffed up. Might be dangerous, but man, do I want to see a dragon or some other form of mystical magical creature? So, uh, yeah, and it's actually interesting to hear the legends, or at least Sarah, you know, for once they see themselves as heroes. They're not just like these outcasts traveling through time, doing all this weird stuff. They see themselves as heroes, which is pretty interesting. And I wonder if we'll see that theme play out throughout the rest of season four. Now, this all seems to be from episode one, because I don't think they filmed anything else apart from episode one. So it seems like episode one is going to take place in the 60s in various parts. And it's in the 60s that we meet our first, uh, our first one as a magical creature in the form of a wonderful unicorn. So um, I don't know if they're going to pop up like this is just randomly out there. It's almost going to be like, you know, anachronisms where things just are, are displaced and stuff like that. It's going to be interesting to see, interesting, sorry, to see if that's the case or not. Um, but yeah, we made a unicorn look pretty good, very shiny. And uh, I wonder who's going to uh, get most entranced by this unicorn. It'd be hilarious if it was Mick. And we do see Constantine enter. Now, we know he's going to be in the season. Um, I wonder if he, the, like, magical things are going to start popping up, which brings him back in. But it seems that it's going to be that he was, like, visited, shall we say, by the darkness that leaked when Malice was released. And that's him coming back to Sarah and saying, look, you might think nothing's, you know, everything's back to normal and nothing really escaped. And I was jeering you up when I brought that dragon's head in. But yeah, something screwed up and we sort of need to fix it. 
So we don't really see too much about it in the trailer. I think it's because of CGI because a lot of this magical stuff would be CGI. Or maybe they don't want to spoil it yet in this trailer. Um, we don't know, obviously. Uh, Legends did start filming uh, like a couple of days before the rest of the show. So, you know, it could you could argue maybe they should have had a, a better trailer, but it could be CGI-wise and stuff like that or post-editing and stuff that hasn't been done. They didn't want to, you know, show anything that looked a bit weird. We do actually see Jimi Hendrix in the trailer. This was him here, like Mick bumps into him. I'm guessing when the, you know, this group, when they're in the 60s, they're at Woodstock maybe or a musical festival like that. They might not call it Woodstock, but, you know, give off the impression that it is Woodstock where Jimi Hendrix would be. There is another bit where you see like they're at like, a, like a, an air hangar and Ray was there. I think Zara was there as well. Not too sure what else is going on there, but that's another scene that we know will be in episode one or it could be a storyline where, you know, sometimes the legends split, like some go to one area, some go to the other. So we don't have like eight people in the one area they might be doing that in episode one and we do finish off the trailer with like the meta joke if you want to call it about a dragon being good for ratings and well ray isn't lying let's be honest ray isn't lying it would help the ratings he does say we had the few dedica dedicated fans i do talk about gary who is will be back this season and was at the panel for this uh uh for legends season four and um, yeah, I'm one of those dedicated fans and I'm sure a lot of you watching are as well. But thanks for watching guys. As I said, not much to really go over in this trailer. We obviously can theorize about the villain and stuff. Will it be connected to Constantine or is he just being visited by the darkness elsewhere that's maybe giving him hints as to what the big threat is? Let me know in the comments. Of course, if you got, if you enjoy the video, I want to say, drop a like would be much appreciated. And of course, if you are new to the channel, make sure to subscribe. I'll catch you later guys. Goodbye.